Ah, can't be asked for trouble at the moment. I mean, you're a bellend anyway. I thought that was your name, actually, bellend. And I doubt you could cause any. Trading jabs with Luxa is hardly the entertainment I was looking for. Let's go. See you later, dude. Bellend. About a drink, eh? You need me a drink? Hello and welcome to another episode of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And we were here in the cantina after speaking to uh, Luxa and her ghastly friend. Uh, gonna get a drink. So let's do that. Welcome to the entertainment module 081 Cantina. How can I assist you? Uh, by getting me a drink of some sorts. I don't have that dialogue option, unfortunately. What sort of entertainment do you have here? We feature Citadel Station's most talented all-bith band around the clock, as well as live Twi'lek dancers. You won't find any holograms here. Oh. Casual Pazak players should be able to find a friendly man in the game room. Or, if you're a bit more seasoned, we have daily tournaments with some of the best players in the Outer Rim. Cards too slow for you? Try your hand at Citadel Station's swoop track and see if you can challenge the all-time records. Last but not least, we feature only the finest cuisine and beverages from Ryloth to Coruscant. Oh, really? Yeah, well, that sounds fantastic. I must say, I'm very interested in playing Pazark. Because why not? I don't understand your problem with the Republic. It's not like Onderon hasn't benefited from joining. It was one of the darkest days in our history. Talia sold Onderon to the Republic, and what did we receive in return? Nothing. In exchange for the blood of our soldiers, the prosperity of Isis has been stripped to decorate dead planets like this. Look, if it weren't for the Republic, you'd all be speaking Mandalorian by now. And because we accepted the Republic's aid, we should be indented to them forever? You make it sound like the Republic turned Onderon into a prison colony. Perhaps. Only that the Republic did not even conquer us. Our own betrayed us and allowed the Republic to take what it would. Hmm, interesting conversations. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't know enough about it to, to make a comment on about it. I'm just enjoying the Twi'leks and the drinks. Hello, Corin Fault. Is there something I can do for you? Uh... Never mind. <laughs> I don't care about the Zerk at the moment. We might as well talk to Luxor instead. Hello there. Hmm. Fresh blood at the cantina. Enjoy. She Your drinks are on me. We should talk. Later. Ooh, okay. What kind of talks? I mean, you remind me of, like, someone that's drank too much, uh, blackcurrant juice. I mean, you're very pink. Who are you? If you're asking me that, handsome, you're better off not knowing. Tell you what. You just enjoy yourself, and if in the future we have business together, you can come back and we'll have a little chat. Oh, I like chats. Atten, what do you think, mm -hmm. eh? I know you'd approve of this. Right, the Zark. Uh, Zerka's mercenaries are getting out of hand, and they're too much for the TSF to handle. We need Republic troops to restore order. Yes, but Pazark. Hey there! Care for a game of Pazak? Oh, yes, that's what I've been looking for. Pazak. Uh, I don't have any cards, actually. Let's play, even though I don't have any cards. Sure thing. Just for fun, or shall we lay some credit down? Uh, for fun now, because I'm not actually quite sure how to Let's play. Let's have a seat and get to it, then. Okay, so... We have... Um, oh, so there's numbers. I think I remember playing this game on the older game, the first game. Uh, and you have to get to like 21, I think. I suppose we can use all of these cards, really. Do I want to use this side deck? Uh, yes. Was it 21 or was it 22? Ugh, I don't remember. Plus four. 
What happens now? Oh, I can choose another. Uh, well, I don't want to end my turn. Oh, can I end my turn? And then he goes or she goes, sorry. Okay, so I'm on eight. She's on 18. Uh, I could go for another one. She's decided to stay. There's 14. That's why well, I could beat her now. Hey! But I've used one of my best cards. 3, 18. We can stick or we can go ahead. I'm going to stick. She's probably going to get better than me. I can tell. There you go. I knew it would happen. These automated games, I tell you. Six, seven, eight, nineteen, or oh, eleven. I have to go. Both on nineteen. I can. Uh, might as well stand. What? Twenty? Eighteen? Twenty-eight. Well, there's absolutely no way we're going to be able to get that down, so we lose. I think. We're trying to get to 21, we're only going to... Uh... Stand. Your opponent wins the set. Okay, best out of three. Nine... St uh, oh, yeah, it's quite, that's quite good. 18. Shall we go for the big one or not? 23, but we can reduce that to 19. Or... I don't think that's... Uh, so 19 now. And I'll stand at 19. 16, 24, 20. Oh, so hard. Luck was on my side this time. Up for another game. You mean the computer was on your side this time? I think you fixed the odds somehow. Uh, yeah, perhaps later. <laughs> I'm not good at swoop racing. I'm not good at bloody... I'm not good at anything. Someone needs to tell me that I'm good at something. You. Tell me I'm good at... Oh, you do, actually. You do. You do. You, you tell me how much of a good Jedi I used to be back in the days. Long ago. Okay, so uh, I've kind of lost track of what we're supposed to be doing. Uh, do, 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 do. Hawk's ID. So we... Uh, release you from house arrest. You must remain on this board station... Da, 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 da. Well, I'm going to go and speak to Zerka Corporation. And that was in the... Well, near the entertainment... Oh, no, this is the entertainment module, actually. I think it was on the other side of the entertainment module. And I'm going to go and speak to them because... And there's only one reason for this. And it's basically the fact that... I don't remember coming out this way. Yeah, there's only one reason for this. And that reason is that I cannot be fucked... To listen to the Athorians speak like blah 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 blah, because it, it is just it is <laughs> it's driving me insane. Okay, so we're gonna go and speak to Zerka Corporation. Tilusia, TSF Protocol Droid, and this is where we were before we got released from here, didn't we? Welcome to Entertainment Module 081's TSF Station. How may I be of assistance? Lieutenant Gren said to come here to get the Ebon Hawk and the rest of my possessions out of the impound. I will call up the appropriate information. Oh, yeah! Now. One moment. Searching. One moment. I regret to inform right. you that the Ebon Hawk is gone. What? The TSF believes it was stolen and is currently investigating. Oh, you lot sound like normal police. They come to your door, tell you they're going to do something, and then bugger off. Oh. <sighs> Stolen? How is that even possible? It seems the Ebon Hawk was transferred to Telos' surface instead of an impound dock. However, both the requester and the point of delivery are unknown. In addition, the vessel is not showing up at any government-sanctioned landing site. I would conjecture that it has been stolen and the TSF records have been illegally accessed and modified. I knew it! That stupid T3 unit stole our ship. It's probably joyriding through the system right now, laughing at us. Laughing at me. <laughs> that is unlikely. While your utility droid is not accounted for, numerous satellites track all incoming and outgoing vessels. 
There is no record of the Ebonhawk leaving the system. Wait, you're saying the ship's actually somewhere on Telos' surface? I don't understand. Telos' atmosphere is highly corrosive outside the shielded restoration zones. Where else could someone land safely? I'm sorry. I'm afraid that's all the information I have for you. Of course, the quarters in Residential Module OE2 will remain yours until the situation is resolved. No. Uh, yeah, can I get my possessions back at least? We need to actually find the ship, though. This is a bit ridiculous, to be honest with you. Fortunately, your possessions were kept in the armory and were uncompromised. I will open the door for you so that you may retrieve them. You Good. will find them in the security lockers. Uh, yeah, yeah. I need my ship. So, is isn't there anything more the TSF can do? Like, get my bloody ship back? Not beyond investigating the matter and extending our offer of free room and board. A free room and board. <laughs> so, we get to stay in an absolute shithole while our ship that's probably worth the. Oh, it's probably worth you times a thousand. And we can't even. And all we get is a tiny bloody room that doesn't even have three beds. Okay. What am I supposed to do now, then, you piece of junk? I am not qualified to answer that question. However, it is unlikely that someone could steal a starship from under TSF observation without considerable backing. If your vessel has been stolen, there is a fair chance that the Exchange possesses relevant information. I do not know what else to suggest, beyond waiting in your quarters for further word. But, uh, uh, you know what? Y you can't be angry at him because he's a droid. If you're a human, you or an alien, or whoever, something they can actually think for themselves. <sighs> okay, fine, fine, fine. Bugger you then, piece of junk, crap. Ugh! Well, at least we can get. Don't tell me all of our stuff is in different lockers. Yes, it is. How annoying. Why don't they just make one locker? <laughs> we have so much crap. Okay, so now we have to re-equip everyone again. <sighs> All thanks to the TSF. Uh, don't need breath mask for now. Reflexes, insulated gloves, uh, vibro cutter. Was it? Was it vibro sword? Fully upgradable. Did I not have upgrades to this? Uh, I think it was this one. So this is the problem now. I don't bloody remember what I had and what I didn't. Atten, we equipped it. Atten's, Atten's ribbed jacket. Is he not already wearing that? Oh no, he was wearing this. We, we gave him this, didn't we? Yep. Um, demolitions. And we gave him blaster pistols, I think. Arcanian heavy pistol and disruptor pistol. I think it was that. I think it was that. And then it was... Oh, this is testing my memory, this is. <laughs> Uh, reflex package, awareness, reflexes for Atten, and then for her, she was, apparently her hand-to-hand -hand combat's really good, so I don't know whether to give her a weapon or not. Rhodian blade, what's that? So, there's balance damage, critical threats, quite high. Okay, it's not suitable for weapon upgrades. Uh, well, we might as well just give you that then. Vibro sword, because it's got the highest damage. Cardio regulator, give her that. Atom might as well have the same thing. And she's got the uh, retinal... Uh, retinal? Oh, it is retinal, yes. Retinal combat implant. Right, that's fine. We've all got our weapons back now. We're all happy. I haven't... I'm not equipped with clothes, proper clothes. Part 1 robe, minus uniform. 
Okay, we'll just wear that one then. Right, off we go. TSF soldier. Officer. You're not a soldier. Okay, right, back on this bloody road then. Where, where does this lead? Shuttle Bay. Um, I, don't, I don't know if there's anything here for us though. I don't think we're supposed to be going this way. We need to go to the exchange, I think, and Zerka Corporation. So we're going, the, we're going the complete wrong way at the moment. About this way. I said, just walk straight into a bench. Cantina. Don't want to go back there. Unless we can go back for Luxa, Atten. I mean, I'm sure she wouldn't mind. Oh, come on. Look how long she takes to bloody walk. Oh, this is why we shouldn't bring an old woman with us. Just rolling through the entertainment module. Yes. And that takes us back to... That probably takes us back to where we need to go, actually. Residential 082. Yep. Need to go this way and speak to... Zikarp. Uh, Zarka Corporation. If there is an option to do that around here. Uh, what's that over there? And what are you standing in front of? Something we can't go in. Great. Zerka Corporation, there we go. Rightio. Okay. I am B4D4, Administrative Assistant for Zerka Corporation's Citadel Station Branch. How may I help you? Uh, yeah, tell me about Zerka. Zerka Corporation has operations on many systems, providing everything from medical supplies to starship weapon systems. Here on Telos, Zerka Corporation is involved in the restoration project, which Zerka hopes will serve as a model for future operations of this nature. Okay. <laughs> but nothing else to say to you then, apparently. I'll just be going then. Right, Zerka Corporation. Oh wait, I just realized we, we didn't answer Zerka Corporation before. Maybe maybe we should have done that. Or we can try and go and speak to them anyway. They did try and contact us, but I was too angry at that time to to take the call. Because we were trying to sleep. I knew you'd come eventually. I am confident that we will be able to reach a working agreement satisfactory to both you and I. But where are my manners? On behalf of Zerka Corporation, I would like to be the first to welcome you to Telos. Oh, cheers. Thank you. Uh, yeah, what kind of jobs do you have? I've decided to... No, we're not helping the Athorians because of... Ugh. It's not even the fact that they don't speak English. It's just the fact that they don't really speak anything. It's just a mumbo-jumbo. And there's only so much you can take of repeated language. Okay, so you, meant to, you mentioned work. What kind of... What sort of jobs might you have Our for me? primary concern on Citadel Station is the restoration of Telos's surface. The Republic is eager to revitalize Telos as a benchmark for other such efforts in other systems. While a generous amount of credits has been budgeted to Telos, the bumbling of Chodo Habat and his Athorians has squandered away much of these resources. For a project of this size, judicious planning and thrifty spending of resources is a necessity, something Habat fails to understand. Nonetheless, Zerka remains optimistic. There are many jobs we need assistance with. For someone with your experience, you would be well compensated. Compensation is always a good thing in my book. Uh, Yeah, go on then. No one else seems to be complaining. Zerka has been managing the restoration project without the assistance of a droid for some time now. Habat has commandeered the new droid intelligence that was to be delivered to the station. I'd like for you to meet the shipment at Dock Module 126, Shuttle Bay 2, and bring the droid back here before the Athorians foul things up again. 
Yeah, you want me to steal the Athorian's droid? Hmm, don't know about that. Wasn't here for that kind of work. Requisition, if it helps. As the Republic's fund for the restoration of Telos is now divided between both parties, it really isn't stealing, as you put it. It will save the Republic time and money if we cut through the process of having a droid transferred to us. It will be better for Telos in the long run. That is still stealing. Like, yeah, if you want me to do this, it will cost you. Because this is pretty out much. This is not really something that I would do normally, but if it has to be done, it has to be done. I mean, it's not like I'm killing anyone or anything, but, you know, they're gonna have to, I'm going to have to be well compensated for doing this. Don't worry. Zerka wouldn't expect you to work unpaid and won't subject no, you to veiled threats and coercion like Kabat. For your help in this matter, you will be paid the sum of 250 credits. Uh, yeah, you can, you'll have to do better than that. Otherwise, I actually will go and work for the Athorians. You're right. 300 credits would be much more reasonable. That's, that's only 50 credits more. That can buy us, like, some lunch. Ugh. Hmm. Oh, I don't... Ah, oh, this is... Shall I go and help them, or... Shall I help the Athorians? It's a difficult decision. You guys are just really quiet behind me, so it doesn't help. Fine, fine, fine. It's only a droid. Anything else? We're not doing it, okay? And we got paid 300 credits, which is pretty good, so I guess that's okay. I don't know. Moral choices are hard. Excellent. I will secure credits for your payment immediately. Oh, and here. You might need this to get into the hangar. Ithorian can Yeah, this is what I'm saying. We, we, th This was bad, guys. This does feel bad, but I... I but there's... Hello. But there's money involved. That's that's this is this is what we need right now, okay? We haven't got th think about this, think about it. No, it makes sense, it makes sense, right? We haven't got guys, 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 just stand this still for a second. So we haven't got a ship. Okay? We haven't got a ship. Uh so we need to get to the ship, or we need to buy another ship. So we need money to do that, guys. And I don't think the Athorians are very rich. So that's one Point to Zerka, I suppose. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, this feels terrible. I mean, you guys are the worst friends ever, okay? If you... Oh, if you could actually help me out in this predicament, then we wouldn't have this problem. Um... Uh, uh, no, we don't have the 300 credits yet. We'll, we'll uh, go back to the two aliens after. See what they've got for us. Um, yeah, so the shuttle bay. And then from there, we can commandeer the Ithorian's credentials, eh? That's a better way of putting it. Commandeer. I think this, he looks a Thorian, but I guess if we're going to steal it, we shouldn't talk to him, but... Oh, come, do we have to talk to him? Transit... Oh, no. Okay, I guess we're going to have to speak... Oh, no. I need to get into the bay. Here are my credentials. Great. Oh, that is annoying. Um, that was easy. See, stupid Thorians. Open bay two door. And the droid? Ah, oh, there he is. Well, that's not him, but... Oh, that is him! Hello! I'm glad you're here. I'm the only man the TSF could spare, and frankly, I got a bad feeling about this. Excuse me, Master, but it seems we have some additional visitors. 
And you guys are? They were from the cantina. Well, at least he was, the ginger guy on the right. Yeah. Thug, uh, exchange maybe? Time to take you down to side. Where that came from? Kill him! Ah, ha, ha. Where that came from? Where that came from? Die, Where die, that came die. From? Master, one of the assailants was carrying this. It looks like it looks as though the blast was heavily modified. Uh, you know what would be good if Zerk had paid us 300 and then we could take it back to the Athorians. But I don't think that would be happening. Oh, this is this is just. This is just, I, I can't lie to him, I can't lie, even though he's a big, blobbery, flat face. I can't lie, I'll take it back to the Athorian straight away, of course I'll get to Chodo right away. I, oh, oh no, it feels so bad to lie, oh, this is such a difficult time. Okay, okay, okay. Fine, fine, right. Let's think properly about this. Let's think pragmatically. We're taking it... We'll lie to him. And we'll take it to Zerko because they're paying more. Okay? It's no harm done, really. Yes, follow me, Bron. Let's go, dude. Are you following us? Oh, do have, no, sorry, we have to speak to him, don't we? I will trust your judgment, Master. Lead the way. I don't understand. I was just told that I would be taken to the Athorian compound. I was to be given to an Athorian, Shodo Abad. The Republic has decided to entrust you, yeah, to Zerka. I see. In that case, please lead the way. Ha ha ha! Excellent. I see my faith in your abilities was well founded. We'd like to get this droid into service as quickly as possible. Opo Chano? Greetings, Executive Lorso. How may I be of service? Just plug into the mainframe and get to work. Right away, Executive Lorso. You may go, Chano. I'm sure you have many repairs to see to. Money? Please? Now then, your payment. Here are the credits agreed upon. There is another task I would like you to perform for me. It doesn't involve uh, going on my knees, does it? Joke, joke, joke. <laughs> Uh, whatever gets me paid, yeah. I mean, that sounds so bad. But yeah, what is it? What is it? You proved that you can handle yourself quite well in dealing with the retrieval of the droid intelligence. The next matter of business I would ask of you is much more delicate. When we first set up here on Citadel Station, the exchange was already quite well established. Lopax Slusk had more influence over business matters than the Telosian government. To ensure our success, we involved ourselves with the exchange. And now that we have a handle on the situation, we wish to 
unentangle ourselves from them. If you know anything about the exchange, then you know that they would not take this well. Slusk is loath to have his hands removed from any business on the station. So a more direct method will have to be taken. To put it plainly, I want you to kill Lopak Slusk. You want me to kill Link? Oh yeah, the baby would be good for that. I realize it won't be an easy task. A Slusk keeps himself well protected. You would be well compensated for it. Any ideas how to get him then? I have a feeling they won't just let you march into their offices. Luxa is Slusk's second. She spends little time in the exchange offices, though, preferring the cantina in the urban module. She might be able to set up an appointment. Yeah, I don't like it, but you leave me no choice. Good. I will be happy to continue our working relationship. Dark side point. Uh oh. Guys, I think something bad's happening. Oh, damn it. This isn't good. This isn't good. This isn't good because now I'm getting dark side points for killing an exchange boss, which in t well, that doesn't really make any sense because the exchange boss I thought was a bad person anyway. So if anything, I thought, what the hell is this? Wait, can you move around like this? No. Wait, how do you get? How do you? Hello. How do I remove myself? Oh, here we go. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. Okay, so Lopax Lusk. Bad. Oh, this is not good. Dark side points. I feel bad about this. So we need to go to Entertainment Module 081 and talk to Luxa. Okay. Our dearly beloved Luxa, who I am so dearly fond of. I'm gonna go talk to her. Hopefully, we don't have to kill her. It'd be a waste of good genetics. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Do you know what? For such an old game, right? It's it's surprisingly good looking. I don't know. It does feel like I'm in the Star Wars universe. It does. It really does. And no, that's not just because of the Jedi robe. Okay, I know what you guys were thinking. Um. So we're nearly there now. And we need to go to... Oh, damn it. I've just walked past, haven't I? Just completely... I got lost in the walking and talking. Canteen up. Uh, here we go. Lux. Hello there. Hmm. Fresh blood at the cantina. Yeah, you already said that. Um, I'd like to meet Lopax Slusk. I'm told you can arrange that. Is that all? What a disappointment. Yes, what you were told is true. I can arrange meetings with Lopax Slusk. But you'd have to give me a good reason. Um, yeah, on behalf of Jenna Lawson, mm -hmm. Zerka. Well, that's hardly reason enough. Tell you what, I heard about what you did down at the docks. I could use someone capable like yourself to do some work for me. Just consider it a little test. Hmm. I don't like playing games. This is like one side or the other, and I'm already doing something bad on one side. And I know the exchange is going to be doing stuff bad on the other side. No? How disappointing. But don't worry. In addition to setting up a meeting with Slusk for you, I'll also pay you for services rendered. <sighs> I take it there's no other way? No. I'm a reasonable woman. Help me, and I'll help you. Fine, 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 fine. It's not like we have any other choice, is it? <sighs> Good. Rejection is just one of the many things I don't take too kindly. Yeah, I can tell. So what is this test of yours then, eh, Luxa? I need to make a transaction with two bounty hunters that have recently arrived on Citadel Station. Very simple. Weapons for credits. I want you to go in my place as my representative. They're being very careful, and I'd rather not be bothered. Here, 
This case holds the weapons they'd like to purchase. I was not told the place of the meeting, only to go to the medical unit in residential 082 and await a communication. Sounds like a setup, yeah. I... <sighs> hmm. They'd be very foolish if that was their plan. I'd hope they knew better than to try and cross the exchange. Uh, how many credits will I be receiving? Yeah, that's the only thing I really care about in this situation, to be honest with you, Luxa. Well, and other things, including you and myself, but, uh, we won't talk about that just now. In exchange for the weapons case? 500. You'll receive your cut from that amount. Okay, fine, fine, fine. It's a setup, obviously, but I'm sure we can handle it. And I'll be waiting. Waiting with what, eh? Right, so, where do we need to go? Because I always forget this. Residential model 082. Do I have to go alone? Okay. So we need to go to residential zone 082 west. So that is where we'll be going. 